it was early afternoon and it was nice and quiet on the train and I seen this guy going to the loo. I was on ticket check and I was just walking down towards the front of the train. The train stopped and I thought the guy would have gone off there. Anyway, I was coming back through the train and this gentleman was coming out of the loo. I asked for his ticket and he said he had a ticket and he basically tried to find this ticket that didn't exist uh, for a good couple of minutes. Anyway, he said he might have dropped it or at least it might be where he was sat. So we went there to where he was sat and the conversation continued that he had this ticket uh, even though he couldn't produce it and I just basically said he's going to have to pay for a new ticket. He said I'm not going to pay for a new ticket if I've already paid for a ticket. This went on. Uh, eventually, uh, when I said listen you're going to have to pay for a new ticket for the umpteenth time, he pulled out this platinum card and stuck, stuck it on the table and said, you're never going to have one of these. Um, and I just took it and went to make a payment. Before I'd done that, he snatched the card back off me and said, I'm not going to pay for another ticket. I've already paid for a ticket. So we went back to that again. I basically reiterated that he'd have to pay for another ticket. And then he punched me. Uh, my nose was bleeding. Uh, anyway, I restrained him and he was dancing around in my grip and when I was quite sure that he wasn't going to hit me again I released him. I called the driver who got the police to come. I was quite surprised how quickly they came actually. Uh, and he didn't hit me again which was good because I think if he had I think I would have hit him. Enormously tempting just to take him out. I mean your pride's been hurt, you've been hurt but I just decided to walk away. Yeah, I gave a statement, and then I was a witness. I'm glad I was a witness, because it seems like a hassle at the time, but it wasn't a hassle. And of course, he didn't get away with it then. Uh, the thing I'm proudest of is that I stayed in control of the situation. Took control and I walked away. I might have stood a little bit further away from him, though. <laughs> no, but seriously, uh, I don't think I was lippy. Um, I just couldn't believe that this... This small guy turned round and, and whacked me. Although I shouldn't have been surprised, really. I mean, did you know, he was a solicitor. It turned out he was a solicitor. I couldn't believe that. And now it turns out he's got two things I haven't got. A platinum card and a criminal record. <laughs>